Everybody is talking about digital platforms, whether it's digital freight matching, you know, visibility, or like you said, you know, sending the documents back, all of this. Hello, everyone. Um, welcome to our fireside chat. In today's chat, we're going to talk about why small carriers and owner operators are finally getting the respect they deserve. Um, in US truckload market, over 90% of the capacity is provided by these small carriers. Um, especially in times where um, freight volume goes um, from boom to burst or bust to boom, these small carriers play an important role in providing that flexible capacity. In today's um, session, we'll hear from uh, Ben Shukart from Snyder on um, how these small carriers play an important role and what Snyder is doing to really um, help this uh, this community. Ben, uh, welcome to our fireside chat. Hey, Prasad, great to see you. I'm, I'm thrilled to be here. Uh, great topic, great event. Thanks. Um, so if you could take a couple of minutes and introduce yourself and uh, Schneider to our audience. Sure, sure. Let me uh, let me start with, with Schneider. I think, you know, Schneider, um, you know, 85 year plus company, really known, um, you know, known brand in the trucking transportation industry. And I think when people think of Schneider, they think of, um, you know, orange, Omaha orange, uh, trailers, trucks, containers, our professional driver force. And really within Schneider, um, it's made up of three business segments. You've got our traditional truckload uh, group. Um, intermodal and logistics. And um, logistics is made up of you have brokerage, you have um, power only, supply chain, engineering, freight under management, warehouse, and of course our Port Dre um, operation. I, I'm really here today uh, representing brokerage. So a um, little bit about myself. Um, been with the company um, over 20 years. And my current role is Vice President of Operations for Brokerage and Carrier Sales. So, so what that means is everything um, for Schneider's third-party carrier strategy. Um, so, and then, of course, our, our brokerage workforce, carrier sales workforce. So um, hopefully I can add some value to um, this conversation as, as really um, everything I'm doing in my career and my role is um, working to better service the small carriers and owner operators that Schneider works with. Um, thanks, Ben. Um, that's that's a you know very good position um, to speak on today's topic. So uh, you know I'll, I'll jump right into our talk on our discussion. Um, so how does Schneider utilize the small carriers or owner operators, the small fleets? Um, in their brokerage network and for their customers. Sure, sure. You know, you know, Schneider, we have almost 40,000 active carriers we work with. Um, and so 40,000 could sound like a, a large number of carriers, and, and it is. But when you really think about it, 90% of those carriers are less than 10 trucks. Um, and it really mirrors the macro transportation industry. So everything we're kind of set up to do when it works working with the small carriers and the one truck owner operator fleets is, you know, we're working uh, every day to earn their business. So we're, we're providing them high quality freight that optimizes, maximizes their time. And every day we're earning their business. So we have our carrier sales team, our professional carrier sales team that's aligned to these carriers. And really they're trying to understand the carrier needs and wants, you know, whether it's a uh, long haul over the road, regional, short haul, what are their needs? And really what's the need for that, that carrier or that driver all the way down to time at home and, and those type of, um, you know, needs of the driver. But every day, I guess I would say, you know, we're, utilizing this capacity to then service our customers in brokerage. So we rely heavily on the small carrier, one truck owner operator fleets to service our, our brokerage customers. This, that's very good. And, um, you know, to, to follow up on that question, Ben, um, what are certain things that Snyder and your division in particular um, is doing to really improve um, uh, the efficiency and the business of these small fleets and owner operators. 
You know, first, I, I want to start again. Where I kind of where we started is, you know, first Schneider's a carrier first, and again, we have over eighty-five year, years uh, of history of being a carrier. So I think we're really well positioned to understand how critical the time is, the value of time for the driver. So you know what we're do, we've spent a lot of time on um, not only for our our company drivers but our third party carriers on how do you maximize drive time, how do you optimize the driver experience, um, reduce waste, reduced wait, wait times. So that could be things like optimizing uh, appointments, getting great appointments, making sure that we have real loads for the carriers. Um, we don't do will call or can get freight. I mean, if you, this is real freight from Schneider and it's high quality freight. I call it blue chip freight. I mean, you're getting freight from the best shippers in the industry that we've developed relationships over time. So high quality freight that maximizes um, driver time. And, you know, let me, when you think about, again, we all have an accountability to maximize the driver time and the driver, um, how much time they're driving the truck. And Prasad, one of the, the areas I think we do a really good job at Schneider is, I mentioned we have the 40,000 carriers. Well, we also have 36,000 orange trailers, Omaha Orange. I mean, and now Omaha Orange, because this is the, you know, this is the furthest you could see a color would be Omaha Orange. It's designed for safety. So these are safe, well-maintained trailers, and we have a large power-only group. So these carriers with our orange trailers we have a program in our power only program that's 100% drop and hook freight. So that reduces the live load, live unload. I don't think you could get any better in optimizing a driver time than our power only program. And again, with that program, you're, you're also using, again, Schneider freight and Schneider trailers. And so we can configure that in contract freight, regional configurations, you know, your typical over the road. but. You know, I think that's that's one of the programs we have under Schneider Logistics that you know I see really um, as a value to the small carrier owner operator, and that that program continues to be very popular. Um, and, you know, I think again it's the value of that drop and hook freight uh, that we offer. I'll just add a few things. Of course, we have um, a fuel program. We have fuel discounts. We offer our carriers. Um, we sell our used trucks, our used trailers. Uh, we have quick pay, so we have some of those traditional offerings that maybe a broker has, but again, offering the 36,000 trailers, used trucks for sale, used trailers for sale, that heritage as a carrier I think is really valuable to um, the carriers we work with. That, that's really interesting. It's not just one or two things that you offer um, to help these guys, right? So uh, which brings me to the, uh, the, the, the biggest buzzword of 2020 and 2021 is the digital platform right everybody is talking about digital platforms whether it's digital freight matching you know visibility or like you said you know sending the documents back all of this how is schneider utilizing these digital platforms um you know we we realize uh, for our audience uh, schneider is a customer uh, that uses trucker tools uh, digital freight matching and visibility platforms right um Beyond that, how, you know, what are some values that you see that these small carriers can benefit from these platforms? Sure, sure. You know, for, first I say Schneider is a digital powerhouse. Um, we have, you know, I mean, I just think of Schneider, I, 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 and digital has become sexy, and, and so Schneider's been sexy for a while now. I mean, we are a digital powerhouse. So we have, um, first we have our freight power. And so for freight power, this is where shippers are coming online and they're booking truckload, they're booking LTL, they're booking orders with us digitally. Um, we of course have freight power for carriers where carriers are, are working in that ecosystem also. And also um, really the, the strategy Prasad that you and I've been working on for a while now is meet the carrier where the carrier's at make it easier for the carrier. So, you know, a part of this, this conference or this, this discussion we're having, you know, is really a theme for me of how can you make it easier for the small carrier and the owner operator to secure this blue chip freight from Schneider. And one of the ways is to meet the carrier where they're at. So digital freight matching or digital, you know, with trucker tools and your app, Persad, you've done a great job of aggregating great brokers you know, some of our main competitors together, you've aggregated this volume and put it in the app for the carrier to 
not only pick Schneider Freight, but pick other broker freight in case we don't have a load that fits their needs. And you can do the digital buy. And the, and the digital buy or the book it now, it, it's, the, it's a real load with the rate there. And you can click it right on there, the, the, the book it now, and you get the digital buy and the tender goes right to the small carrier or any carrier, for, frankly, or the driver. And so that's just being easy to do business with and speed. So again, what we're trying to do there is time. Uh, time is money, and um, I don't have the exact stats, but I know you know carriers and drivers are spending a lot of time searching for freight. So the idea here is give great quality freight, reduce the searching, and um, with trucker tools, co-mingle it with other freight so you have more selection as a carrier and you have more time to drive. You know, it's interesting you, you mentioned about the time is money, right? You know, these platforms have one thing for, for this audience, primarily to help them find the best, you know, we talk about putting the right load in front of the right truck, right? That truly happens with these digital platforms and help them optimize their trucks, right? Um, ben, as we, you know, come to the, the, the you know, wrap up our session, um, first of all, there isn't enough time to discuss these topics at length in, in such short time, right? Um, what are certain things that you want our audience, primarily the small carriers and owner operators to, to go home with? Well, I mean, I'll give an advertisement to, you know, how to best reach us is through Schneider.com. So, I mean, um, we'd love to work more with the audience. So the best way to get active with Schneider is through Schneider.com. And then the best way, and we both have it on our shirts, Prasad, you can see a Trucker Tools, you can see a Schneider. Um, whether you're, you're finding us through Trucker Tools, you're finding us through Schneider, um, you know, finding these digital loads, um, finding loads with us. But, I, you know, I'd love to to continue the conversation with more of the carriers and they can find us again through the schneider.com. And like you said, it's, it's, we, we could go on this conversation a lot longer. So I look forward to uh, more engagement with the, uh, the carriers after. Thank, thank you very much, uh, Ben, for, for sharing your thoughts on how this segment, the small carrier owner operator segment has been playing an important role in our industry, but what Snyder is doing to help them, and more importantly, what the digital platforms are doing to help them, right? I mean, like you said, we could barely scratch the surface of this topic in such a short period. But, um, you know, for those who are listening, um, if you're a small carrier, um, uh, don't hesitate to reach out to Schneider or Trucker Tools to learn more about how you could benefit from um, a digital platform to start with. But more importantly, what are certain things that um, large brokers like Schneider they're doing to help you in this ride. Um, in, in my viewpoint, I think um, small carriers and owner operators have always played a very important role in our industry, more so in the last 12 months when we saw the pandemic swing us both, both sides um, in such a short period, going from uh, boom to bust to boom in a couple of months. Um, we wouldn't have uh, recovered from all of that without this small carrier segment. Um, they truly are the heroes of the, the road. Um, they play a very important role in our um, supply chain today. Um, so th thanks, Ben. Thank you for joining this session. Uh, thank you, FreightWaves, for this opportunity.